All right, now sometimes you're gonna end up in an unfortunate position when you're on your back and a guy's on top of you. So we're gonna go in a position that you can kind of relate to. It's called guard, right? But this is where Jess is on her back and I'm in between here and I'm coming in and I'm like, doing whatever I want to do, right? Now, what she doesn't want to do is start messing about with like arm locks or submissions or stuff like that, unless you really know what to do. So, because I'm going to be pressuring forwards here, come this way, just a tiny bit. Bit more, bit more, bit more, come on. So look, because I'm going to be pressuring in here, what she needs to do is get out of this situation altogether and she needs to make space. So, if I'm leaning forwards, first thing she needs to do is push me away with her hands, okay? She needs to keep me back, perfect. Next thing she needs to do is get her knees in. So if I'm constantly putting pressure in, yeah, she needs to push me back with her knees. Go and push. Yeah, then you want to start to shuffle back and get your feet in the way. Yeah, now you've got your knees in the way. Perfect. Then you want to kick me off hard. Yeah, good. Then you need to get up to your feet. Okay, so she's getting up and she's escaping. Okay. If you know what you're doing, you can start doing, if you really need to, submissions and stuff like that. But what will happen is, if you don't know what you're doing, people will tell you, oh yeah, like sit up, grab me around the head, like a, a headlock, like this. And they start pulling me down. Yeah, and like squeezing. But if you don't really know what you're doing, or I'm much stronger, I'm just going to get out. And then she's still back to square one. So she needs to get out of this position. Best thing to do, because I'm going to be giving forward pressure. She's like, I'm pressuring in. She needs to push me away. Good. Yeah, you need to fight it. Good. Gets her knees in, gets her feet in, makes space, kicks. Good. Get out. Good. And then gets up to her feet. Exactly. Okay, so three things you need to use from this position. You can strike if you need to. So look, if she needs to use her elbow, she can elbow me in the face hard. Or spike elbow me in the head from that position. Oh, lovely. Nearly cut me open. But that's the thing, look, she hit me, connected, and now look, I've gone, oh, like that, and I've backed up. She's got her space, go, get out, get out, get out, get out, and gets up to her feet, okay? So look, you don't really just want to do nothing and just like push them off without a meaning to it. So look, if I'm here, and I'm doing whatever I need to, yeah, get your knees in, go, kick, fight, and get up, yeah. You're gonna have to scramble, okay? It's just the way it is. But main things that you need to do if we break it down, so look, if I'm here and I'm leaning in, she needs to get hands free. So she gets her hands free and starts to push me away and push me back. Cool. If she needs to strike, she can use the hammers, little ones, good, or big elbows, yeah, or spike elbows. Those work really nicely. Okay, because look, I'm in this position, my head's right here. She can smash it go repeatedly, yeah, or spike ones. Bang, bang, bang. Gets her knee in. Okay, now there's space now. So if she pushes with her knee, she's made a bit more space. Push. Yeah, push me backwards rather than yourself upwards. Push me back. Yeah, good. Gets her feet in the way now and starts to kick off and move backwards. Yeah, good. And then gets out of there. So that's it. So if we do it a bit faster, she's ended up on the floor. I'm coming in, I'm putting pressure in. She needs to fight me off. Gets the knee in. Good. If I'm coming back, yeah, get up, up, up. And that's it. Okay, that's all you want to do. Don't wait there and try and do anything else. And if she needs to add in a few more strikes, so that if we're here, I'm coming in, she starts striking me first, bang, 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 then she gets a knee in, pushes me away. Go, 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 be blind. Yeah, yeah. And get up to your feet. So like we said, this is just for complete beginners who don't know what they're doing. They don't know any submissions or you know, any arm locks or triangles or guillotines, etc. or any ways of just pinning the guy. Just push them off, get your knees in first, strike them if you need to, get your feet in, kick them off, and then get out of there yourself. And uh, that's how you want to get up from your feet.